I'm on sight. Another thing I wanted to talk about, this one is quite a serious one-ish. Um, yeah, so um, you guys know the recent, um, not really recent. So Anele Tembe's father, um, he has come out and he's done, I think this is his first ever interview since everything that happened. Um, so just for those who don't know, Anele Tembe, um, ex fiance, I guess, of late rapper AKA. Um, she's also late. Um, tragic uh, death that they had. And yeah, I don't even know how to get into it like that. But yeah, so her dad, he's uh, done an interview with the news and he pretty much speaks about the court proceedings that were meant to happen prior to. Um, AKA is passing and what was apparently was supposed to happen, who was meant to be prosecuted, who was meant to da 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 da. But obviously, since you know, um, AKA had passed, he can't really be prosecuted into debt. But he's going to share some of the developments, which I think a lot of people didn't know, myself included. And we're just going to listen and then we'll talk afterwards. Okay. So, yeah, his name is Moses Tembe. So let's just give a listen. Are you talking about the prosecution of the person who was there when this took place? Uh, obviously, uh, at the room um, uh, where uh, Anele is alleged to have uh, fallen, uh, he he was with someone, you know. So uh, the, the police never told us who was going to be prosecuted. The police advised us that uh, uh, they were, um, uh, you know, had a strong case and uh, they will prosecute. I almost have a sense that you don't want to say his name. Oh, gosh. And I tried to watch this before so that you guys don't have to see his ads. Sh pardon me. Yeah, she was in the company of uh, uh, Kinen, uh, very true, uh, but that it follows. Uh, that uh, uh, Kinen um, was going to be prosecuted and that Kinen was um, uh, uh, guilty of anything. No one knows about that. You know, uh, to that point, it, it has always been uh, critical uh, for the family. Uh, so as you heard, he said that Kenan was meant to be prosecuted. So meaning that he was meant to, you know, stand trial, I guess, in whatever sort of capacity. I don't know if he was charged in what sort of way with what charges. Um, but he's alleging that Keenan, a.k.a. a.k.a. R.I.P., was um, meant to be prosecuted. Uh, to, to have Keenan uh, on, the, uh, on the box, whether as a witness uh, or as a, an accused, uh, for us, a proper closure uh, required that the last person who was with uh, our daughter be present. The Tembes say it was very difficult to stay neutral in the matter, but the family says it did. As you'd remember, uh, Kinen was not just a boyfriend. Uh, uh, Kinen was a fiancé, and uh, uh, Kinen had uh, uh, approached us. Uh, he wanted to marry uh, our daughter. We, we had accepted him as a son too. And, you like uh, him? Uh, uh, definitely, mm -hmm. uh, I like Kinen. And uh, uh, but believe me, I'm the first person to tell you that uh, uh, Kinen never put his foot wrong in front of me. He never said anything uh, amiss. Uh, I liked him a lot. Um, uh, I, I met him uh, on stage. Wow. No, that's, um, to be honest, well, that's, I didn't expect him to, you know, say, say that, you know, which is quite interesting. Um, but then, you know, he is still the father and he still wants the truth is you are you know he wants the truth for his family his family i guess deserves the truth so it is sad that whole situation is just like really sad just to see how everything just played out for the both of them you know it was like on some romeo and juliet vibes you know not to like i can you know <clears throat> um personify it or anything like that but it was just like it's just really tragic how their lives both and you know 
Like you, you wouldn't think that when they met, aka Anele, that two, three years after them having like this relationship, that they both would have just um, passed away in like such tragic manners, both of them. So very interesting, very sad. Um, I wonder, I guess, what happens to the case, you know, because you can't prosecute someone that's dead. So I guess maybe the case just, just gets dropped, which I thought that was the initial standings. I think the whole public thought that the case just got dropped. So yeah, that's interesting. I feel for for this man and, and his family. It must be a lot, it must be a lot. But yeah, so yeah, that's the whole uh, Tembe family news press that i wanted you guys to just listen to well 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 you know you might